patient, the one Patrick wanted me to see, Mrs. Mm -hmm. Lauer. Her new test came back, and her cerebral spinal fluid still isn't draining, so I'm not sure the drug protocol is working. You think surgery is indicated? You know, I've had success with uh, intracranial hypertension, so if you want, I could uh, take a look at your patient. Make you come anywhere near my patients, and I will have you up on charges before you know what hit you. Okay, you know, it doesn't need to be like this, Dr. Scorpio. We are professional colleagues. I'm not risking myself or my patients just because you do a decent sanity impression. Okay, that's your choice, and I respect that. I will be with uh, Mr. Donatella. All right. You could have handled that better. I didn't say anything that wasn't true. She's insane. Look, you're an excellent Dr. Robin, but you're not a psychologist or a psychiatrist. Lisa's sanity is at your call, so here's how it's going to go. Dr. Niles is a very valuable member of our team, and there will probably come a time when I need you two to work together, and I'll expect you to behave as a rational health care professional. Doctor, I need to talk to you. I can't imagine what you think you should add. I have a lot of respect for you, both as a woman and as a doctor. But when you go off on Dr. Niles like that, the crazy stick points at you. <laughs> hey, that feels right. You're listening? Robin, you have to be more professional. And I know you can do it. You did it with me when I was first trying to get you to notice me. You gotta be cool. You just gotta back off a little bit. Back off? Listen, I'm doing this for your good, not Lisa's. Well, it doesn't sound like that. Sounds like you're sticking up for your ex-girlfriend. That I brought anyone into this investment. Especially my sister. Don't worry about me. I didn't invest anything more than I could afford. Yeah, well, I wish I could say the same for Elizabeth. I tried to warn her, but she saw visions of college funds, family vacations. Is it that bad? No. She said she'd make it work, and I believe her. She's been through enough already. I tried to raise three boys in this stubborn streak about being independent. Anyway, I'm glad this isn't going to break your bank. <laughs> With everything that's going on in my life between Lisa and my wife, I'm not worried about an investment. What, is there more? Don't worry about that. If not the two of you, that's something you two can work out between both of you. But as chief of staff, I'm concerned about her job performance. You can't blame Robin for struggling after everything Lisa's done to her. I'm just trying to be objective here. All Lisa's crimes for lack of a better term, are alleged. And she doesn't at all appear unstable. But Robin, on the other hand, is increasingly volatile, even erratic. But Lisa is smarter than we ever thought, and crazier than I yeah, could have even I imagined. Know, I thought the same thing, but the, the, the longer this goes on... Lisa did everything that Robin is claiming. Where's the proof? Look, I want to believe you, I really do. I wish Lisa never came here. But she did, and she's a great doctor. And I am in no way defending Lisa. Dr. Nicholson. But you've Dr. got to look at this from another perspective, Patrick. Whether or not Robin was okay when this all started, she's definitely not okay anymore. What's your name? Secret admirer? <laughs> My husband brought flowers on our first date, and he hasn't stopped since. Wow, lucky you. Oh, I found the right man to marry me. That makes facing this illness easier. Knowing that I have someone who loves me to face it with me. <laughs> Are you married? Uh, so I see you went for a walk today. How was your balance? That's so good. I'm still having blurred vision. Okay, well we are going to try and reduce more of that swelling, but all things being considered, uh, you're making real progress. I hate the headaches the worst. I hope that new medicine helps. Your new medicine? I had my first dose during lunch. It was on my chart. Uh, yeah, there it is, right there. Excuse me, I have to check on something. I'll be right back. Okay. 
Schedule this surgery for the day after tomorrow. Make it early. It could be a long way. Will Dr. Tudal or Dr. Niles be attended? Are you really asking me that? This is a hospital, not a third grade lunchroom, Trudal so... Trudal Epiphany. Oh, I, know, I just hated it didn't work out. Well, I investigated the firm before I put my money into their R&D, and it's not like you didn't warn us. You've been really nice about this. Well, I've had my breakdown for the year. Thanks. <laughs> You're handling it very well, and I appreciate that. Dr. Niles, do not sabotage my patient's care just to get back at me. Is that clear? <laughs>